Hey guys, thanks for coming back. I still have this cold, but I feel a little bit better today. And what I wanted to do tonight is do my review on the Bare Essentials, Bare Minerals Beyond the Basics. And I actually also picked up um, today at Sephora um, the Prime Time. And it's a foundation primer. This is the first time I've ever used it, and I really like it. I don't know how else to explain it, but it just kind of smooths your your skin and really preps it so that the foundation will stick and just look smoother. It's a very clear, I don't know if you can see that, but it's a very, it goes on clear. And then it just kind of smooths out the skin, fills in pores, and like I said, I really like it. Today's the first time I used it, and so I actually recommend this product, um, especially if you're using Bare Minerals as your foundation. So the Beyond the Basics is a really nice kit, I think. You really can't go wrong. There is a a uh, handout or like a little booklet that it comes with plus a DVD so you can learn um, how to use each product step by step and so today I'm gonna show you what I did and I'm gonna start off with their their multitasking face in bisque. That's the color. And you can apply this to anywhere you have redness. Sometimes I apply it under like the eyes and um, around my nose. Um, anywhere where there might be any redness. This is a good concealer, but it could be used actually uh, as a pre-concealer or a post-concealer. So you could use it under foundation or over. The other thing the kit comes with is the Bare Minerals Multitasking um, in Summer Bisque. And this is what it looks like. It's it's just a little bit of a warmer tone than the regular bisque. And the way I used this one today is I just put it on my eyelids. And so it acted as a base. Um, that's one thing you can also use uh, the this product for. It has a SPF 20, so it's really good in the summer months, but it could be used all year round. And then it comes with this faux tan. And I know it looks really dark, but you use just a tiny, tiny bit. And you would use the soft focus brush that it comes with. Um, I just washed it, so... It's still really wet, but I also, you can also use just any kind of powder brush. Um, this is my, my posh powder brush that I actually use while I'm waiting for this one to dry. And you just dip it in and swipe it all over your face where you um, na would naturally tan. So forehead, down the nose, um, cheeks, chin. Um, it, it's, uh, it's, a really, it's a really nice product because it just gives you that right amount of color 
um, without looking bronzy. So I really like that product. And then it comes with so Soft Focus Glee. And this is supposed to be applied to the apples of your cheek. And again, you're supposed to use the Soft the Bare Essentials Soft Focus Brush, um, but just for demonstration purposes, I'm going to use my flash brush. And it just says to use on the apples of your cheek so you would smile and put it on the apples of your cheek. I've already put all this stuff on, so that's why I'm not um, doing a, a full-on tutorial. So that is the Soft Focus Glee, and the last step would be their Bare Radiance. And this would be used as an all over color. It kind of gives a sun kissed, dewy look. Um, yeah, you would just put it all over. I really like this brush. Um, yeah, that's the Bare Radiance. And that's that's the kit. It comes with the the bisque, the summer bisque with SPF 20. Comes with the faux tan, the um, soft focus glee, and lastly again it is the bare radiance. So. I really recommend this kit. I like it. It's very natural, and like I said earlier, you really can't go wrong. Um, I don't know why I waited so long to to purchase this because I've been using the foundation probably two years now, and this is actually the first time I, I uh, purchased the prime time. And I don't know why I waited so long either, but. I think watching these YouTube videos have kind of helped me um, get more ideas and try out the new products. So um, I hope you like this video and if you're thinking of getting the Beyond the Basics kit, I do highly recommend it. It's a really nice kit and I also recommend the, the Prime Time if you're into um, foundation primers. It's a really nice feeling, and it really smooths out your skin. And that's my video for tonight. Um, thanks for visiting. Uh, let me know if you have questions, and feel free to comment or leave a message. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye!